Some people claim that the fall of the Roman Empire is due to like lead contamination on the like vessels that used to uh, be used for keeping the wine uh, that led to you know a lot of behavioral issues. If you were explaining this to me as as a five year old, like why is why is lead bad? Um, and where is lead found? Like walk us walk us through just the basics of of what is lead and why is lead bad and like how prevalent is it? Yeah, so yeah, lead is a known neurotoxin. It's particularly bad for children and women. It uh, gets stored in bones actually. Um, so when you're this pregnant uh, woman and there's a baby being formed, storing the bones actually gets released and forms uh, the skeleton of the of the baby but then that actually affects uh, brain development and it's you know been linked to a lot of behavioral issues uh, and a lot of disease um, and yeah it has had a lot of you know historical impacts actually some people claim that the fall of the Roman Empire is due to like lead contamination on the like vessels that used to uh, be used for keeping the wine and uh, that led to you know a lot of behavioral issues uh, and health issues um, construction material that's you know really cheap to use because it's very malleable so it's very you know cheaper than copper or you know other materials to to make plumbing material but uh, in other places where maybe we hadn't thought about it so much as you know where there it's pumps um, like hand pumps they recently you know, in the past five ten years have also been found to have uh, lead exceedances you know finding 80 percent of the pumps having exceedance levels of of lead so i think it's a more widespread problem that we realize there's a lot of medical evidence that show that it's really bad and we're just gathering pieces to to realize that it's actually probably more prevalent than we even think